uh, hard to get to open mics when you can't leave the house. So, uh, here we go. <sighs> you know the best place to go? I want to make sure this is informative. Because uh, there's a lot of shit on the internet that nobody cares about. Let me give you some advice, guys, out there, if you're out there. Uh, do you know the best place to get laid is a gay bar? I know, most of you already know that. You think, like, maybe a strip club, but no, it's a gay bar. And let me tell you why. Because you can hear the conversation that the woman has in her head before she goes out. She's like, I don't want to deal with guys tonight. I don't want to get hit on. And let's then call my friend Gay Johnny. I'm just going to call Gay Johnny, and let's go to the gay bar, and we'll just dance, and it'll be so much fun just dancing, and... It sounds great in her head, but, you know, two hours later, four shots of Jägermeister down her gullet, and little Mr. Low Self-Esteem peers around the corner. She's looking around, gay Johnny's hooked up eight times in the bathroom, and she can't even make fucking eye contact. She's just like, am I pretty? Am I pretty? Am I pretty? Am I pretty? So find the first straight throat in the building just to shove her tongue down it for validation. That's... All I'm saying, it's uh, it's my advice to you, because I happen to take psychology in college. Uh, knowledge is power, you know. Um, for instance, I don't know if you know, did you know that physiologically speaking, the pleasure center of our brain uh, engages before any logic or reason or societal convention? So you should always wear underwear around dogs. And you should never have sex in your kitchen with your wife when your little Australian shepherd is out because she will lick you directly in the asshole. Directly in the asshole. And, and I don't care what you think about bestiality. There'll be a, a, a split second the time it takes for one neuron to, you know, fire across one synapse to the other uh, where that's going to feel kind of good. Just, you don't want to be caught all, oh, crap, I mean, of course you're going to stop the dog. Of course you're going to stop the dog. But but you'll know how that felt, and you got to wear that like a badge of shame. It's not good. It's really not good. Um, you know, smell is the sense that's most closely associated with memory. Um, so... Uh, <laughs> Interesting little fact, I, out of all the women I've been with, and I'm not going to get into numbers, but there's a percentage, a fairly high percentage of women who have been really freaky. Uh, and they've all owned ferrets. Now, I don't know if you've ever smelled a ferret, but it has a very distinctive stench. Uh, it, 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 you notice it. it. It burns its way in there. Uh, so, you know, I mean... I'm just saying, after the fourth time I go home with a chick on a one-night stand and uh, I'm wondering if I'm going to get lucky, I smell a ferret and I end up having crazy, kinky sex that night, like, some weird Pavlovian response system is starting to get wired in. It's, it's totally, it's not my fault. I, uh, I'm sorry. I, uh, I was trying, so I was trying to explain to my girlfriend why I had a boner in a pet store. Uh... She didn't really... Well, she asked the obvious question, which was, are, are you into bestiality? And, uh... My brain works really quickly, so of course, before I could think, is this a good idea, I told her about the dog. I told her about the dog and the asshole, and it was, only, it was one time, it was very short, it was a very short, short period. One synapse, from, but, but it was... I'm just saying, you get an unexpected tongue in your ass in a sex act, it's not gonna feel bad. <laughs> I've been in orgies. wasn't the first time. Uh, anyway. <laughs> the brain is a weird organ. Um, we actually can study... Uh, we've seen... By we, I don't know, some fucking university or something. But they've been able to look at uh, rats' brains while performing tasks and have noticed that the pleasure centers of rats' brain... Uh, activate much more highly when they have to perform a task and then receive a reward than if you just give them the reward. So, uh, I mean, that makes sense. Uh, I thought I'd try to apply that personally. I didn't even realize that, but I've been doing it m myself for years. I, that's why I, uh, that's why I piss my girlfriend off on a regular basis. Because, yeah, she's gonna... Bitch, oh man, forgot that one.
pleasure center of brain something something. It's people.